Yeah, I we are know. friendly and dependable, and if they need help, to let us know. Sometimes we know, like the couple across the street whose house was struck by lightning last week, and uh, so I went to see about it, and she said, well, of course, we don't have any electricity because it ruined all the wiring in the house. Uh, and she said, we're just dying for some ice. So I emptied our ice maker and took it to her and uh, was not a very Christian act, although she thought it was. I put in some cans of diet root beer that our son who'd been staying with us liked before he moved to uh, New Mexico. <laughs> and I put those in there and she said, oh, and that root beer, that was just absolutely delicious, you know. If somebody's sick or something, take them some food or check up on the elderly. One time it was very funny. Someone moved next door to us, and I took them some, I think they were called Good For You Muffins, and she asked something about a beauty shop. And I said, well, I go to one right up here off of Anderson Lane. I said, it's not very big and fancy, but it's fine. And come to find out it was her aunt. I was so glad I didn't say anything bad. I'm so glad that my parents moved here, that um, I just want them to know that I'm really proud to live where I am and that I'm really proud that there's so many different pl people here and everyone's going to help each other. I'm just, I want them to know that that's, that's the way a neighborhood should be. And I think that's what makes Austin good is you have like the Crestview neighborhood and then you'll have an Allendale neighborhood and you'll have Delwood neighborhood and everybody in their neighborhood is trying to keep it nice and keep it a good community so you have all these big these communities working together to make Austin a better city and that you know it's really quality of life they always talk about quality of life and, and I think Austin still has a pretty good quality of life. Life itself is challenging you have to what is it, look on the bright side my mother used to say she came from Germany you have to take the bitter mit the sweet. She wouldn't say with, she'd just hang on to mit. You have to take the bitter mit the sweet. And that's about the truth. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. <laughs>